What's up with the record business? Hey, what's up? So, how do you make love last in a relationship? How do I make love last? Well, it helps it that my wife is a toilet paper, too. Uh, if you can count on her not to sass you back on things or decisions that you make, that helps to ease conflict in your relationship. In order to make love last, you got to put the woman in a place. You got to say, hey, woman, you take out the garbage tonight. Hey, woman, you bring me the food. Hey, woman, you make the money. Hey, woman, I need to watch the TV. See, you tell them things, and they listen, because they're inanimate objects. See, my wife is like a toilet paper tube. I don't know if you noticed that. We got married recently. <laughs> thank you. Oh, I didn't know you got married. Mazel tov. Yeah, thank you. Thank you about that. Um, but like I said, yeah, I boss her around, and she pretends to do what I tell her to do. And that's how we ease conflict in the relationship. Especially conflict solving. That's how we keep love alive. Meatwad, how can we fix our problems in Iraq? Ooh, that's a toughie. Iraq. Ain't that, that, that's that country that we've been dealing with over there in Europe, ain't it? Ain't it? Ain't it? Well, right. Not as much Europe as in Asia, but... Sure, I understand. Lots of problems over there, lots of problems. And we need solutions, you know. We brought them people democracy, you know. They don't need to be blowing us up with all this business. What I would do, I would have a surge in troops, another 21, 22,000 people. Bring them over there. Focus on Baghdad. Don't worry about Fallujah. Fallujah take care of itself. Let the Kurds, the Sunnis, and the Shiites all get in the room together, decide how they want to build their government, and... You know, I think we'll get out there by Christmas. But, you know, that, that's just me talking now. I got a cat toy for a brain. And I voted for Bruce. <laughs> Meanwhile, is global warming a reality? I, I hope that global warming is a reality. Because this winter we didn't pay no gas bill. Um, I don't feel no global warmth inside my house. And I had to wear two pairs of socks. Um, I ain't got no feet. So... You can imagine how I put them on. Ways to prevent global warming, you ask? I would say don't fart. If you keep your hearts in, I know global warmth's gonna get out. And that's the truth, y'all. Need what? Um, so what's a non sequitur? What's a non what, Dudamer? A non sequitur. <laughs> your beans are beyond belief. <laughs> Case in point. So do you think genetic engineering should be used to create a stronger species of human beings? I think it should be used to enhance women's breasts. I think uh, it should be used to make everyone blonde, uh, because I think that that's a good color hair. I think uh, I'd like to see um, people uh, start to have wheels. I don't know if that's possible, but I'm sure they could do it in one of them colleges. What else? What else? What else? Oh, I'd like to free the world of disease and uh, put an end to world stuttering because, you know, lots of people stutter. That should be eradicated immediately. What else? I believe that's, that's all I believe. All right, one more question for you, Meatwad. What's the one true religion that the whole world should be united in believing? Well, now understand, I'm not a polytheist. I believe in, in, in one faith and one God. But I would say, uh, what's, what's the religion where they, what's, what's that thing where they worship Godzilla over in Japan? I believe that's, um, isn't that Shintoism? I don't know. What I would say is don't do that. Whatever you do, don't go to that church. Godzilla still. Well, thank you very much, me. Why do I appreciate you talking to me? All right. Take care.